tonight on Be Something Wonderful, how to create your reality by not doubting it, the Neville Goddard way. I am your host, Tom Karen, and this is the Be Something Wonderful studio of higher consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Creators, welcome back. I got a few emails from subscribers over the last couple of days, essentially saying this, Tom, I believe that imagining creates reality. I believe in my imaginal act. I feel my wish fulfilled. I feel the naturalness of it and the vivid reality of it. It's when I come out of the imaginal act and I'm back in the 3D world and I don't, I don't feel that new reality. I start doubting it. Doubt overcomes me. Can you unpack that? Guys, we're going to unpack that tonight and more. What does Neville say? Neville says an assumption if an assumption creates its own reality, then there is no such thing as fiction. Hear this, this is big. Stay with me. If an assumption creates its, its own reality, then there's no such thing as fiction. If there's no such thing as fiction, doubt makes no sense. There's nothing to doubt. You create it all. So. So if you believe imagining creates reality, and you do, if you believe in your imaginal act and you feel the vivid reality of it, the realness of it, and you do, then there is no fiction. You're creating it. Doubt can't possibly make any sense. This is huge. What else does Neville say? Neville says, as your goal is accepted, as your wish fulfilled, the assumption of your wish is accepted, you become totally indifferent to possible failure. Hear this, totally indifferent to possible failure for acceptance of the end, acceptance of your wish fulfilled, acceptance of your assumption of your wish fulfilled, wills the means to the end. What does that mean? It means that higher power, that Christ in you, that dimensionally larger you, that dimensionally larger reality brings it to you. It manifests in 3D. That's big, right? That, that, it's the acceptance of your wish fulfilled, right? Accepting that end. Why? What happens when you accept that end? Acceptance of the end wills the means to the end. That higher power brings it to you. This is big. This means what? This is big. This means there's no possibility of non-fulfillment. If there's no possibility of non-fulfillment, there's no, it makes no sense to doubt it. Hear this, right? Let, and then Neville pulls it all together with this quote. By assuming the feeling of the wish fulfilled and then living and acting on this conviction, you change your future in harmony with your assumption. Let's break this down. This is big. He says, by assuming the feeling of the wish fulfilled, by assuming it, feeling it, and then living it, meaning accepting that end, accepting your wish fulfilled, accepting it, accepting that, there, that there's no possibility of failure, that there's no possibility of non-fulfillment, right? When you accept that, you're now living it and then acting on this conviction. What does he mean by acting on it? Telling a new story, acting as if it's already done. Then what, what happens? You change the future in harmony with your assumption. You create your new reality. That's big. You assume it. You feel that wish fulfilled. You live it. You accept it. You accept the end, you accept the wish already fulfilled, you accept that you already have it, and then you tell that new story. You act as if you already have it. You act as if you already are that person you want to be. When you do this, and when we know that an assumption creates its own reality, and there's no such thing as fiction, then doubt makes no sense. Why? There's no possibility of non-fulfillment. You're totally indifferent to possible failure because failure is impossible. This means doubt is impossible. This means you create it all. That's big. That's how to create your reality without doubting it, the Neville Goddard way. I am your host, Tom Karen, 
And this is the Be Something Wonderful studio of higher consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification button, like and share our videos. That's how we get our message out. Hit us up on Facebook at Be Something Wonderful, on Instagram and Twitter at Tom Karen, our website at TomKaren.com or BeSomethingWonderful.com or write me anytime at info at BeSomethingWonderful.com. I would love to hear from you. Until next time, this is Tom with great love. See you soon.